Hi, my name is Stuart with Metro Home Theater Group. Today we're going to discuss features and functions of Spyclops products. Now we're going to review a couple of the advanced features of the wireless NVR kit. And the first thing we're going to do is adjust the screen resolution. To do that, we're going to right click, select System Setup, select Screen Setup, and here's where you can adjust your resolution. Right now it is set to 1080p, uh, but we have the ability to adjust between 1024 by 768, 1280 by 1024, 1366 by 768, 1440 by 900, or 1080p and 50 and 60 hertz. Once you select the different resolution that you would like to use, you will need to select it and click apply. When it asks to reboot, you will need to tell it yes, and when it reboots, it will come back at the new resolution. The next feature we're gonna discuss is how to change the camera titles. And to do this, we're gonna select channel setup, and then we're gonna select channel OSD. And here, for each of the channels, we select which one we wanna change. And if we wanna change from cam two to door, we just delete cam two and type in door. And hit apply. And now camera two is referred to as door. The next feature we're going to discuss is how to change the motion detection area. To do that, we're going to right click, select system setup, select channel setup, and select video detection. From here, we choose the camera that we want to adjust and then select area edit. And in this area, we can either add or remove areas for video detection. Out of the box, the entire area is selected. If you only want to detect motion in a small area, the easiest way is to clear all, select the tiles that you want to detect motion, or if you have a small area that you want to not detect motion, it's you can fill all, and then you can uncheck the areas that you do not want to detect motion. Once you have completed the area that you want to detect or not detect, simply right click and select return and click apply. The next feature we're going to discuss is video playback. To do this, we're going to right click, select video playback, and we're gonna select manual search. Here, you can choose which camera you'd like to play back, the type of recording that you'd like to view, and also the date and the time that you would like to view. In this case, for this example, we're just gonna do a broad search. We're gonna search for everything that was recorded today. So we're gonna to leave today's date and time, and hit search, and there we'll see we have two sections of recording that we've done during our demonstration here. And for this, we'll select the area that you'd like to play back and hit play back. Playback can be done at real time or up to eight times. Once you find the area that you're looking to play, you can resume normal playback by simply hitting the play button. Once you're done, press escape and hit cancel and you are back to the main menu. For more information and helpful videos, please visit us at metrahometheater.com.